How should you prepare for the upcoming massive skin update in Tower Defense X? If you don't know already, this Friday there's going to be a new skin update, which will include these skins, the Criminality X TDX collaboration skins, a new emotes feature, and the long-awaited skin exchange system, along with two new maps featuring water. If you want to be ready for this update, the first thing you should do is join the TDX Discord server and the TDX Pantheon. If you prefer to play in the squads and you want to be updated on the game before even the content creators can show you, this is where you're going to want to go. It will also help you with tip number two, the current best grinding strategy, the Iron Slayer. Since there's going to be a ton of new skins in the skin crate soon, you're going to need to stock up on coins for the update. As long as you have the towers, then this is one of your best bets to stocking up on the coins for the update. And if you want to learn more about the Iron Slayer strategy made by the TDX Pantheon, you can check out this video about it in the top right corner. Tip number 3 may anger some of you guys, but let's be honest, the criminality skins are like 99% going to be for Robux. The Tower Battle skins were for Robux, and these likely are as well. So if you really want the criminality skins, then your best bet is that you're going to have to stock up on Robux somehow. Maybe do some extra chores around the house, maybe you have a job, maybe you can use Minecraft- Wait, not Minecraft, what am I saying? Maybe you can use Microsoft Rewards for free Robux, but however you get your Robux, that's how you're gonna get the criminality skins. Just don't go searching too far for free Robux and getting yourself scammed or something. Tip number four, like and subscribe to my channel so you can get more content about Tower Defense Sex. <laughs> Anyways, tip number five, just remember to have fun. Don't lock yourself onto grinding the Iron Slayer or Expert Mode if you start feeling super drained by it. And take a break from TDX and go outside if you're feeling bored. Well, anyways, the last tip I can give about this topic is that there are going to be two new water maps with this update, which may not seem as important, but that could mean that Patrol Boat and Warship are going to be a bit more meta in the future. So if you feel like doing it, you could save up money to buy those as well, just in case the new water maps are that good. So that's how you should prepare for the upcoming Tower Defense X update. You should stock up on Robux, stock up on coins with the Iron Slayer strategy, and join the Discord servers if you have not already. If this helped you out, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button so I can hit 50,000 subscribers by the start of the summer. It's only 4 months away, and although that may seem like a long time, time can really fly by fast these days, so gaining 20,000 in that amount of time is going to be a huge challenge, but I know you guys can help get me through it. Remember, never put off tomorrow what can be done today, and peace out guys. Have fun, have a good day.